Hey guys, and welcome back to another video on my main channel. And for today's video, I thought I would go over the steps that I use to coin roll hunt. So, there are several steps for me to coin roll hunt, and I'm going to go over those today. Um, so, I guess I would say the first step would be s studying the role. Like, seeing what what attributes about the role are interesting, what kind of role it is, and also that includes seeing if there are any enders is the very first step, for me at least. Um, the second step would be opening the roll and then dumping out all the coins. That's the second step. The third step would be looking through each coin one by one to see if there are any interesting coins. Fourth step. If not, um, you just dump all the coins back into the bag and go on to the next roll. And then that those steps continue through every roll you hunt. So that way you know the steps after every roll and it's easy to know. Um, it's pretty easy to remember. Um, there's just like four or five basic steps to it. Um, and me, when I followed those steps, I found an uncirculated weedy today. So that's what it can get you if you follow the steps. You don't necessarily have to follow the steps that I use. You can follow pretty much anyone who made a video or anyone who likes to coin roll hunt or knows how to coin roll hunt and has done it many times. Um, anyway, I think that's pretty much it. I don't think... You really need to stress out about it when you're coin roll hunting. You pretty much need all the supplies you really need are the rolls, um, something to open the rolls with, a, a mat that you can use to dump the coins into the bag. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. You don't need much. Um, but. Anyway, I guess this is pretty much it, so if you guys enjoyed this video, subscribe to both of my YouTube channels, turn on the notification bell for both, like, comment, and share for both. Um, anyway, go Creative Collectors. Peace.